Hey everybody, David the Pro Solo Flipper here. I uh, just want to do a quick little video. This will be a little bit off topic from my normal reselling stuff. I picked up a Century Safe at an estate sale today that I just wanted to use for personal use. Um, I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to, it, what the situation was with it. it. They had the key, the safe was open, but the safe was locked in the open position. Um, there was the key, but they didn't know the code. Uh, so they couldn't get it to work. Um, I don't know if I got a good deal on it or not. I probably didn't, considering the, the current situation with the safe. I paid $40 for it, um, but it was the kind of safe that I've been looking for just to have stuff uh, locked up, paperwork um, to be fireproof or whatever. So here's how I remedied the situation so that I can use it now. Um, it's it, Like I said, it's for a unique situation. The safe uh, is was open, with had the key, uh, in the locked, the door was locked in the open position, and I didn't didn't have the code, so that's what that's what this video is going to be about. Okay, here's the safe that I bought. Uh, it is the Century. Down here is a sticker that shows the model number and the serial number, so it is model S three eight seven seven. So that's for the one I bought. So it, when I bought this, uh, this is kind of the situation it was in. The 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 key was in it, just like this. The door was locked. I couldn't. I couldn't do this because I didn't know the code, and it was still locked. Um, so I, I got online trying to figure out what it would take to figure out the original code. Um, there is a way to get it from Sentry, and you have to send twenty dollars or twenty-eight dollars, something like that, along with a letter stating that you are the owner of it and with the model number and serial number that's that's right here um, and that letter has to be notarized so i didn't really want to have to go through the trouble of getting a letter and getting it notarized and setting enough money and then waiting for a week or two to get the actual code uh, so i got online to do a little research on google and youtube to see if i could figure out how to get it how to get the original code or how to get you know how to get this thing to be usable so um, that being said, this is, I did see a video on YouTube for a different model of safe where he got, he opened the back cover and inside was a barcode that he scanned and, and got the original code. So that was my intention was to pull off this cover on, on, on the inside of the door and see if I could scan that. So here's what happened. Um, Here's the inside. This is the cover that was on it. Um, it was locked, so I couldn't get this cover off without really breaking it. So I just kind of broke the tabs um, on each side, pulled the cover off, only to find that there was no barcode in this model. But if, if this is not locked, if this is not locked here, then there are some tabs here and here. There's one on top and two more on the other side, on the other end here that you can push to get that cover off uh, without breaking it. Um, so what I learned from looking inside this was that, you know, these, these move in to unlock it. When you don't know the code, there's a little thing that I've taped off here, a little tab that pops open up that the tab that the code uses to, to uh, pull, pull this thing in so that this metal piece can move past and unlock. See how that works? So, um, but then what I also realized after playing around with it, that even though that's in, if you don't have the key in there, it's still locked. You can't open it. Um, and that must be some kind, of some kind of thing with here on this thing. So uh, what I did was I taped this off so that it's always in a position so that this can move. Um, and now I can, so now it's closed, push the key, pull it out, and now it's locked. Um, I, I don't have the code to use, but I don't really care about that. I do have the key. There you go. So now I have a lock and safe with just the key. Just find my mean. Fairly simple fix. And we got it, we got it going. So that's for the, how we got how I'm gonna use this center safe. That's it.